in this video, we are going to have a quick overview of the Swift XR, a detour. We have the top section, which contains the devices options, theme controls, and the export options as well. We have the middle section, which contains the layers panel, the page settings panel, our workspace, the inspector, and the configurator. And lastly, we have the third section that contains the design components panel and the assets manager. To get started creating our project, let's add in a basic design component. We could also add a 3D component into our column. So we would select the AR model viewer component and drag into our column. By default, we get a SwiftXR 3D model. And to change this, we have to go over to our configurator which houses the different custom properties of our 3D model viewer. So to do this, let's drag in one of our 3D models, which we have by default in our asset manager into this drop down here where we can add our 3D model. So let's drag in our Swift XR ball. And with that, we're able to change the 3D model that we have here. So if you have custom 3D models, you can import them into your asset manager and manually change them here as well. Now we could also add a text component to our canvas. And with our text component, we can add descriptions to our 3D models. We could say Swift. And to edit the properties of this text, we can go over to the inspector and change the typography and we can change the font of the text we have copied here. And also we can change the font weight to make it much more bold and also increase the font size. Now that we have our project here, we can also customize the way it looks by going over to our decoration and changing the background color, starting from our 3D model. And now that we have this, we can go over to the publish section to publish our project and let others view it on the web. We can do this by hitting the publish button and this should publish our project and generate a link for us. Now our site has been deployed successfully and we have our very first Swift XR project, which we can also view on mobile and on our laptops and PCs as well. 